The second parameter that we're testing for is pH. The pH is a measurement of whether the water is acidic or alkaline. The full pH parameter goes from 0 to 14, and 7 is considered as pH neutral. In respect of your hot tub water, we are in fact looking for a pH reading of between 7.4 and 7.6. So your hot tub water is ever so slightly alkaline. There are two reasons why we're aiming for a pH reading between 7.4 and 7.6. The first consideration is bather comfort, and the second consideration is the sanitizer to operate at its most optimum performance. For example, I have a 300 gallon hot tub, I've tested the pH of the water and I've got a reading of 7.8. So I need to reduce my pH from 7.8 to 7.4. For reference purposes, one teaspoon of pH reducer will in fact reduce my pH by 0.2 in 100 gallons of water. So because I've got 300 gallons of water, I do in fact need to use three teaspoons of pH reducer, which will reduce my pH by 0.2. I apply the pH reducer directly into the filter compartment with the hot tub running, leave for 10 minutes, and then I need to make the second application of three more teaspoons of pH reducer. Then I should have achieved a pH reading of 7.4. Our second example is we now have a hot tub with 400 gallons of water. And after the pH test, we have established that the pH reading is 7, so in fact the pH reading is low. So we're going to have to use the pH increaser from the spa care kit to raise the pH of your spa water. Again, the same principle applies. A teaspoon of pH increaser will increase your pH by 0.2. So because we have a 400 gallon hot tub, we have to use four teaspoons of pH increaser to raise the pH from 7 to 7.2, adding the product directly to the filter compartment with the hot tub ru water running, wait for 10 minutes, then add the second application of four teaspoons of pH increaser to raise the pH from 7.2 to 7.4. Finally, retest the water and you should have achieved your desired reading of 7.4.